Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So I wanted to share with you guys a swap. It's a mini swap for my friend Angela. Um, I will link her in the description bar below. I know she has an Instagram, so I will link it below. So if you guys could please show her some love or follow her if you're not. Um, so we decided on a swap, like a embellishment kit swap kind of a deal. So in... It's supposed to be mini, but somehow I got carried away. I don't know. I was just having fun. So, <laughs> uh, this is everything I will be sending her. And here I've got... Let's get rid of the big stuff first. So, in here I have a tumbler. A little Valentine's Day tumbler. I have some socks. I've got some Pop Rock candy. I have some ribbon up there. And, and these little foam picks from Dollar Tree. And I added some foam hearts in there so i got that those foam hearts i got them from packaging from happy mail that i received from my friend and then in here i'm gonna put some crinkle paper in here but this little valentine day box was gifted to me by my friend tanika so i figured i'd pass it on to somebody else um i have some smarties uh, love hearts. I think these are 10 times better than the OG conversation heart candy. I don't know. These just actually taste good. And um, I also got her these little strawberry gummies, which are fire. I really like them. They taste really, really good. This will be in her box. Then I also have this bag from Dollar Tree here. This bag is actually pretty big, but um, I have some goodies in here for her. I have this little Dollar Tree bead box. And then I, I got her some trims when I went to Daiso. So I got her the colors in pastel. I thought they were cute. So I got her that. And then I got her these cute little teddy bear baggies. I think these are adorable. And I'm going to be gifting her these conversation puffy hearts. So that is what's in this bag. Um, in this bag right here, this is an embellishment I was gifted. So I figured it'd look cute on top of this bag as a bag topper. And um, in here, I'm gifting her some Daiso pom-poms. And then I'm pretty sure she likes Toki Doki. Um, the last time I was at Daiso, she commented on one of my stories that uh, she wish she had a Daiso uh, because she really loves Toki Doki. So I got her some washi tapes, a little eraser, um, some notepads, and a little magnet set in there. That way she can use it. Maybe she can use the washi tape for packaging, which is what I do now because I don't buy a lot of washi, but there is some washi that is just so adorable. And I like to use it to, um, for my packaging. So I just think it looks cute other than regular tape. Oh, uh, let me see what else. Okay. In this bag right here, I made this little llama tag and I just added it to this bag that I got from Target. And in here, I put a little sequin mix. And this is just a traditional Valentine sequin mix. It's got reds, pinks, and whites. I think it's cute. I added a little sticker and I added a flat back fuzzy heart. And then this one, this one I got from Joann's from the Pop Collection. And I just filled it with... A bunch of my favorite stuff. I love knickknacks, so I put flat back um, wood veneers. I have charms, flat back stars, hearts in pink and red. I've got really pretty beads in there. I have charms, teddy bear charms. I believe I put three in there. So I have a hollow, a white one, and a brown one, but they're like hidden in there. <laughs> Some clothespins, some pom-poms, um, wire wrap beads. So just a whole bunch of stuff in here. I have like a phone charm in there. Uh, 
just a lot of stuff you guys and then in on the top i made this little dangle for her and i put some wire wrap beads i have a gummy uh lollipop and then i finally used these dollar tree uh scrunchies they look so cute so that is what i put in this bag i hope she likes it and then let's see so for our kits um i decided to make the embellishments and then make kits for her so that she can uh, make her own kits but i did add some extras so let me show you guys this one and this one and this okay so for the extra embellishments, I made these little hot air balloon die. Oh my gosh, you guys, I've had this in my stash for maybe about a year already and I still had yet to use them. So I really love how they look. I actually really love this die. It is so cute. I'm so happy that I finally used it and I hope she likes them. Then I also made her this um, die. I cut it out for her and I put it together. I know you can't really see because of the hollow. So I have some extras right here that I wanted to show you. Because I really love this glitter paper from Michaels. I just think that red looks so pretty. And this is a die that I recently hauled from AliExpress. In my previous haul video, I believe. But it's so adorable. Look at how cute. You can add it to a bag topper. You can add it to an embellishment book. You can add it to an envelope just in the front. You know, if you want to gift like a, a Starbucks gift card. I just thought it was so adorbs. So I put that in here. And then this is a Lori Whitlock bag topper that I just cut out. And I kept it simple because I really love paper print so i just kept it simple with a little uh cluster embellishment on the side so i have that one then i also made her these heart embellishments and um I had been wanting to use these little felt hearts, but I kept saving them for an embellishment book. And I was like, you know what? I'm just going to make an embellishment because they are too cute to keep them stored. So this is what I came up with. Um, this bag topper was gifted to me by my sister. So I just thought it looked really cute on there. So that is how I packaged that guy up. Okay. And so this little guy is a box. Um, this box is from Hobby Lobby. I think I got it on clearance last year. Um, but I just made a little belly band for it. And I have a little flag embellishment here. I've been wanting to make these embellishment guys forever. They've been on my list. So I'm so glad that I finally made them with um, the Main Squeeze collection. Because I really love how it looks. Um, so I made a little belly band and I tied some, I put some Velcro on it so that she can reuse it. Um, but in here, I have some wire wrap beads for her. I made a ton of wire wrap beads. I've got, let me see, I've got hearts. I've got um, these little, I don't know, they remind me like of like little gumball beads. Um, I've got these chubby beads, this one, this big one here. I just thought it was so pretty. Um, so yeah, just a whole bunch of different beads that I wire wrapped for her. Um, so she can use them, make a dangle with them, or whatever she would like. So I made that. Um, I'm going to be gifting her these little confetti tubes um so she can add them to her next swap so i thought that was cool and then okay so these are my embellishments with the kits so uh first up is this guy right here this little mason jar is from jaded blossom and you guys i am obsessed with this little die i'm so glad i ordered it unconsciously <laughs> and it's just so cute isn't it adorbs oh, i love it i love it it's so adorable 
Um, and this die, this die right here, oh, it's everything. I I had been wanting to get this die and I, I kept forgetting. And then I would check on it and I was like, oh, I forgot the die, I forgot the die. But look at how cute this die is. Um, and I just, I thought it'd be perfect to make my kits for her. So, up here I have a little embellishment cluster. And then I did print out a bunch of the ephemera. Um, so I put ephemera in here for her so she can embellish. And then I added some twine right here. And this is an ephemera piece from All Heart. I just thought it was cute. It looks cute like that. And then these I made for her. So all she's got to do is embellish it. I added the sequins. I stitched it for her. It's all put together for her. Okay, and then this is my second one. Um, these are the flag tag embellishments. And I added a bunch of ephemera, my little pom-poms, wire wrap beads on the side. Just made a little bag topper with this doily. Um, but this is my kit. So I added the pom-poms, I added the ephemera, and then I stitched flag embellishments for her. And I added some enamel dots. So that is ready for her. And then I also did like a little tear paper vibe here. I really love how it looks. I was going to stitch it, but then I was like, it already has stitching. And if I stitch it, it's going to look weird. So I figured I'd leave it like that. Um, I really love this die, you guys. This die is just so pretty. Um, this glitter paper from Michaels again. Fire. Love it. So that is my second kit. And then I have this mini kit right here. And these are just little bows, tiny little paper bows. And I paper punched them out for her. She can add pom-poms. She can just add thread to them, whatever she'd like. And then I made a little tiny bag topper here with some trim and this little piece of ephemera. So just a little tiny one then i'm going to be gifting her some felt envelope shakers um so she can use them to gift or whatever she'd like but i kind of gave her the example here so i cut some out for her and then this is my other sequin mix that i'm gifting her so she can use the red one or she can use this one and then i'm gifting her some organza as well so she can make her own um shaker envelopes and then another little Lori Whitlock file again I kept it simple because this is by far my favorite print favorite paper for main squeeze because I love these kind of primitive hearts they're my favorite heart I mean I do love like those really bubbly round ones but these are my favorite I don't know why they're just so cute I literally have them tattooed on my hand <laughs> but um yeah so kept it really simple with the bag toppers because I wanted the paper to be the main focus so that is what i will be gifting her you guys i hope she likes it i hope it's enough um i sent enough stuff for her to comfortably make her little kits i'm also going to be adding these strawberries that were made from my friend janae and my sister i'm going to add them in the box I hope she likes it, you guys. Angela, thank you so much for asking me to swap with you. Thanks, guys, for watching. And I hope you are inspired the way you guys inspire me all every day. And I will catch you on the next video. Bye!